Sustainability is hugely important to us as a business and in fact over the next three to five years we have um, an initiative in terms of our corporate and social responsibility and where we really started to look in terms of making changes and giving back what we're essentially taking away was our bottling and our fulfilment side of the business uh, and we really were looking for a partner that could actually help us in that sustainability so we partnered with Future Pro Logistics which was a really exciting change for us as a business and they are hugely um, involved in the sustainability aspects of, of what they do and that really fitted with our initiatives moving forward. And the first thing we've done is removed all plastic from, from any of our bottles that we're sending out. That was really, really important. Everything we use within our packaging and everything else is recycled. So that was really, really important to ensure that uh, we were sticking to our initiatives moving forward. When I first spoke to uh, Ross and Russell about um, packaging, they had a, a strong desire to have it sustainable materials. Now that was great for us because that's what we, we specialise in so we came up with a solution for them that was not only good as an unboxing experience but also good for the customer to dispose of easily. Pretty simple stuff when you actually put your mind to it and just look into it a bit more. Uh, simple things like instead of you know using normal bubble wrap, single use, uh, they actually produce a sort of recycled uh, kind of card board version of that, um, which is, is very simple to wrap a bottle in. Uh, and yeah, like that, we've changed all of uh, our packaging from single use uh, to recycled options. Um, and it's just simple things like that which make a big difference in the long run. This is our shredding machine. So any boxes that um, we can't use anymore, for instance, how a client sent their products in to us, we would ask for permission to then shred them and we can use it as void fill for um, packages to go out um, and it's just another way that we can keep sustainable and not put things in landfill. I'd like to think what excited Ross and Russell to work with uh, Future Pro Logistics was our commitment to their business, making sure we were providing them with the latest innovation in packaging and technology to support their business as it grows. So this is the hex part of the Flexi Hex. It's got reinforced edges and it's all made of cardboard um, and it's really quite strong and sturdy to keep a bottle safe when it's on its journey. Um, we bought this in to kind of replace an air pack which um, is plastic and you fill it with air so it's just the better cardboard alternative. And the change from how the plastic has been removed from the business has been quite quick. Um, every brand has got on board with it. I suppose the proof in the pudding is making sure the product arrives unbroken, and it has. There's no reason to have plastic. There are good alternatives. It was really important to us when we were reviewing the market in terms of our fulfilment opportunity that we were partnering with a company that, that ran in line with our values. Um, after initial meetings with Future Pro, it was key on their list to ensure that sustainability was, was the top factor in what they do. So that was the reason we partnered with them and it really runs in line really nicely with our corporate and social responsibility initiatives moving forward. I think it's only right that we use sustainable products for the uh, packaging and, and shipping materials just purely for the future generations. It's the right thing to do. Sustainability is incredibly important for Spirit Filled. Um, I think every company should place a high level of importance on sustainability because if we're not going to do it, who is, you can't rely on the next person, you've got to take a look at yourself and see what you can implement to change things. And uh, we're doing that already um, in a you know, short period of our history. We are already making changes to uh, improve our corporate social responsibility uh, and all very positive changes moving forward. And we'll continue to look at ways to uh, evolve the company and be more socially responsible. There's a number of things we're looking to move forward quite quickly. The first being a peat restoration project. Uh, peat being um, a big part of the Isle of Whiskey uh, in terms of the smokiness it brings. Peat is a natural byproduct in the ground and obviously a lot, of it, a lot of it's been taken out. So it was really key to us and runs in line with our, us as a business in restoring those peat bogs, especially in Scotland. Uh, so that's, that's an initi initiative we're taking forward. Also things like utilising casks, when a cask is finished being used for whisky, actually utilising the wood, so making guitars out of the wood, which is a really exciting thing. The litter mill, for example, we've made a guitar from the lid of that wood. We've also done it, as you may have seen, with the feta can cask that we bottled. 
Um, so that's also really, really important, making the key rings for the glass. Again, is really important. So for us, it's about protecting the, the globe for future generations. So that falls uh, in line with our values as a business moving forward. Yeah, so we're very excited to continue this journey on our corporate social responsibility and uh, update and bring our clients along for the journey.